Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play the Piggy Roblox Ellie theme. Okay, so here we go, give you a preview. Pretty creepy and sad at the same time, this song, so it's pretty nice. Okay, G give you a preview right now before we start learning and check it out. Okay, but anyways, so here we go. It's a little bit weird. Some of the right hand motives is played for like an irregular amount of like times. But anyway, I'm gonna teach you exactly how to count all those uh, uh, repeated notes, and yeah, it'll be all good. Okay, so yeah, we'll break it up into a few parts. So we'll break it up into one, two, three, four parts. Okay, first part goes like this: right hand starts on the E here, middle C, go up an octave C, E. Okay, you can do this E, or you can even do a, another octave higher. But anyway, up to you, whatever you like better sounding. So yeah, right hand starts on the E, F, and this is played for four, uh, eight times. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then after that goes E up to A, G, F. Okay, that's it for the first part, okay? Let's do it again. So E, F for eight times. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, E, A, G, F. That's it for the right hand. Left hand is A minor chord, which is A, C, E. It's a fully white note chord, okay? So just one chord. Two hands together for this first part goes like this E and A minor together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, E, A, G, F. Okay, yeah, that's it for the first part, okay? Pretty easy stuff. It's just the first chord and first note of the right hand together so nothing special there okay second part right hand continues goes d e for six times only this time so it goes d two three four five six and then after that d g f e uh, just like that it's a bit weird so it's shorter than the first part okay one more time so it goes d e for second time third fourth fifth six d g f e Okay, left hand we have first inversion of E major, which is G sharp B E. Okay, and same thing uh, for the two hands together. It's just the first chord and the first note on the right hand played together. So yeah, together two, three, four, five, six D G F E, and that's it for the second part. All right. So yeah, uh, back to back the two parts we've learned so far. We play like this. Check it out. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Six. Like that. Moving on to the third part, right hand continues. This time it's a bit different. Go C D for four times. So one, two, three, four, and then B C for four times. B C two, three, four. Like that. That's the third part. Left hand, we have uh the two chords we learnt. So A minor, A C E, and then the first inversion E major that we have G sharp B E. So yeah, you already know these two chords based on the first two parts already. Okay, so hands together goes like this, the so C and A minor together, one, two, three, four, and then the B and the next chord together, two, three, four. That's it for the third part, easy, so one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, just like that, okay, yeah, so back to back to the three parts we've learned so far, we'll be playing like this, check it out. Like that. Okay, moving on to the fourth and last part. Right hand goes like this. Goes A, B for four times. So one, two, three, four. And then G sharp A for five times. It's a bit weird. So one, two, three, four, five. And then G sharp B. Like that. So this is probably the harder part because there's more changing stuff happening. So A, B for four times. So one, two, three, four. And then G sharp A for five times. One, two, three, four, five. And then G sharp B. 
That's then we have the same two chords that you know, the A minor and the first inversion E major. So with that in mind, turn together goes like this, A and A minor together. Two, three, four, and then G sharp and next chord together. Two, three, four, five, G sharp, B. Like that. There you go. So one more time, so together. Two, three, four, together. Two, three, four, five, G sharp, B. Okay. So back to back, all the parts would be played like this, and we finished, okay? So we won't talk through it, and just play. repeating it just like that okay but anyway that's pretty much it okay so uh not that hard to learn once i taught you all the patterns of how many times you have to play each group of like those two notes you just have to count in your head or if you can't count in your head yet count out loud and it'll be a lot easier and then begin to like start to not count out loud once you get better okay but anyways yeah that's pretty much it by the way i've done pretty much a lot of like the roblox piggy themes so go ahead learn your favorite one from the game and as for now that's pretty much it for today's lesson if you enjoyed this lesson, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally there are multiple thousands and thousands of these videos ranging from pop songs of all languages, meme songs, video game music, movie, anime and cartoon theme songs and many more songs of all sorts that I teach. So most likely you can find your favorite song to learn on my channel. Also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. Learn from my piano courses on how to play by ER, improvise, read sheet music, how to play and sing, and many more courses at all types of levels, even for those who have never touched a piano before. As for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.